Hi. <laughs> Your girl had a rough weekend, baby. But I'm here and I'm alive and I'm slightly better. So I was thinking I kind of wanted a chill movie, maybe something that's just a little goofy more than it is spooky scary. But then I was thinking and I was like, no, no, no. <laughs> Let's add to the pain. And I just can't put this off any longer. I'm so curious. And with the sequel coming out supposedly later this year, I figure there's no better time than the present than to finally watch Terrifier, 2016 Terrifier. Now, per usual, never seen this before. I don't even really know if I know anyone that really talks about this that, that much. I feel like this movie isn't really talked about that much, but there's a big enough fan base that I know for them to create a number two. So I don't know. Let me know what you guys think about Terrifier. But before all that, I have to watch it. So that's exactly what we're gonna do today. Per usual, if you wanna watch my full length reaction, go ahead, check out my Patreon. Link will be in the description. Or if you just wanna support the Chan Chan, you can just check out that link and join my Patreon for just one dollar. So, without further ado, let's not ramble on any longer. The curiosity is at its peak, and hopefully, we will get a good movie out of this. Hopefully, I will like it. It kind of seems like I will like it, it seems like something that will be kind of up my alley. And I also need to prep for Halloween, it's basically Halloween, in my opinion. Yes, it is still July, technically, but it's almost August. Like by the time you guys are seeing this, it's gonna be August in like two seconds. So when it's August, ooh, get ready. Get ready for the Halloween content, baby. All right, without further ado, let's go ahead and watch this freaking movie. I will say this, he does look terrifying. I am aware that the clown's name in this is Art, Art the Clown. That's about it. Yeah, I'm spooked out. For sure, his face. He's ugly, ugly. No, we're not. Are we gonna start off with the. Why did I pick this? I'm already scared. I'm sitting here live with the sole survivor of the Miles County Massacre, which occurred exactly one year ago today. Do you remember your initial reaction when you first saw your face? I wish I was dead. People are frightened by the way that I look, especially children. Especially everybody. <laughs> how is your, how could your face actually look like that? Oh my god, my god. There's a lot of controversy surrounding his supposed death. Okay, so I was doing a little bit of research and I, and I know that he, Art the Clown, is from All Hallows Eve. Like this Terrifier movie is his own thing, but All Hallows Eve is... Sorry, he's just really scary. I feel like I should have multiple protectors with me. Sorry, this is important. This is how genuinely terrified I am. I don't, I don't know, I don't know. But All Hallows Eve, I believe, is a completely different, completely different thing than this movie. Completely different in the way that he's just from there and they have like the same characters, but it's like, I don't think I have to watch All Hallows Eve to follow this storyline. You know what I mean? Like same guy doing the same old shit, but it's not necessary for me to watch All Hallows Eve first. Maybe one day I will. Oh my God, I thought she was gonna attack me. <laughs> gonna say why would she say that i was gonna gag at one point okay like we Can get it favor? if i ever look like that promise me you'll put me out of my misery <laughs> well she literally said that she thought of that herself to the victim so you don't have to be a beach about it all right she understands is this movie gonna end with her getting all like effed up fake out fake out fake out <laughs> Oh my gosh. Why did I pick this movie to watch? I'm actually very scared. At least we have these commercials to help us 
Okay, but that's actually like, that was actually really terrifying. I don't, I'm just so glad we have these commercials in between to <laughs> help us out. So I was kind of right in the fact that it ended with her looking like that girl. Oh, you are not driving. Okay. I'm fine. Give me the keys. Give me the keys. I don't get people get so defensive about them being like, I'm not drunk, let me drive. It's like, who cares? If someone else wants to drive, then I'd be like, you can drive. I hate driving anyways. D, what? Look. What? Maybe he'll drive us home. Oh my gosh. I'm so I can't. I need more protectors. Maybe another two hours? All right. Uh, there was an almost Coke product placement, but they scratched out the Coca in Coca-Cola. So, no free advertising here. Nuh-uh. Ugh, he's so creepy. I mean, he actually is very creepy. They did it successfully, making him very creepy. Ugh, stop staring at me. I can't. Stop just staring at each other. Like, someone look away. Or that. Or even just smile. <laughs> Actually, I don't know if I can watch this. Like, I'm actually really creeped out right now. Dude, they also put a pumpkin over the Coca part in mm. the Coca-Cola. Try to cover it up. Excuse me. Can I get a picture with you? What? Oh, Why? Hello? Why would you want a picture with him? Legit, if someone dressed up like him for Halloween, I, I poop my pants. Poop my pants, not pee. I would literally shice myself. Yeah, I'm scared, I'm scared, I'm scared. I don't care if y'all say I'm a weenie. I don't, I just can't. While he's away, I would bolt. Here you go, ladies. I was gonna say, it's taking a while for them to get the okay. freaking food. <sighs> don't, let's not worry about that. That bag, I need to take a in it. I don't know who cares. Yeah, it's come on. You fucking freak! Get over here and don't come back. What did he do? Ramon, grab a mop and some bleach. So you okay? Yeah, I'm alright. Something that needs uh, mopping and bleaching. Oh gosh, now the only two employees are gonna have their heads turned away because they're gonna be mopping up whatever that guy did in the bathroom. What do you think that guy did in there? Kaka. Give me your phone. I'll call my sister. Why didn't you call the sister initially? Ugh. Here's some shit. I want to talk in the morning. What? I'm telling you, these minimum wage workers, they don't get paid enough to deal with the literal crapola. <laughs> what? They actually are gonna just, just sit there. All right, no respect for boundaries. Every little thing I feel like is gonna freak me out, honestly. Should I just let you drive? Yeah, but as usual, you have to be the good Samaritan, so here we are. The good Samaritan, you were drunk. So is the bar really that low? <laughs> I'm so lucky that this movie isn't that long. <laughs> It's not even an hour and a half long. Well, it's an hour and 27 minutes, but potato, potato. Well, looks like he's not gonna get paid. Oh, I knew that was gonna happen. <laughs> okay, that's kind of ridiculous. You're not screaming enough. Well, some douchebag in a costume acting like a racist Halloween. <laughs> All of this is just because it's Halloween. If it was any other day of the week, nah. Jesus. All the people he's killed. He's very strong. His little tongue was still kind of moving. He's like, I'm not getting paid enough for this to get killed. Because it's gonna be a while till your sister gets here. There was no one closer that you could have called? Maybe that guy has a bathroom that you can use. Who? Creepy guy. She's like, not as creepy as the clown. I'm sorry to bother you. Is there a bathroom in there I could use? Guy is even weirder looking than the clown one. How is that guy even weirder looking? In what world? How? The thing you called me when you did, I was about to bomb the hell out of this place. What kind of pest? It's not roaches. Oh, rats. Kids. It's rats. How is this any better than uh, you just peeing outside? Do you need me to wait for you or? I'll be all right. Okay. Well, um, you have a nice night then. See, he seems normal. Why is this movie so gross? I feel like I can't show half of this movie on YouTube because it's just so nasty. I probably won't. Again, how is this better than going outside? We have a major development. All right. She's kind of just like. Uh, Two employees at the Deer Hills Pizzeria 
That's fast. They're not that far from that place either, are they? It's kind of a very stereotypical, uh, I'm a girl, I take selfies and post on Instagram. Stay with the ambulance, all right? That's where I would go. No, I can't watch it, I can't. Oh, hi! And of course, he didn't have earphones before, but now he does. I don't want to see no evil cats, some dead cats. What did I sign up for? For those of you wondering, I still can see the screen technically, just not the main things in frame. Just enough protection for me to watch the movie without having to see the spooky parts. Uh, demon cat, why? Why? You're really going to like it here. This is my daughter, Emily. Oh, uh, what is it, what is it, what is it? Oh, uh, just a doll. Just run away, girl. Punctuality is the thief of time, dear. I mean, I guess, but he's a lot creepier than I anticipated. No, is he there? Yep. Hi! And he already killed the other guy, yeah? Ugh. I like that we're kind of already thrown into it. I mean, this is the very beginning. Not the very beginning, but it feels like it's really early on in the movie. The person that plays this clown is also very good at being creepy, like his movements and everything. Like if this was at like Halloween Horror Nights or something, it, I, I, I don't know. I would literally be terrified as he anticipated. He is the terrifier, but still. She too loud. She's be hush, 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 quiet. If I was in a situation like this, I don't know what I would do. Just do something. I'm scared already. Do something. So uh, she's eventually going to be able to get back to the car, but then she's going to go and see that her friend is. <gasps> ah! See, how is he so quiet? Ugh. Oh no. Oh, girl. No, not the eyes, not the eyes, not the eyes, not the eyes, not the eyes. Nice. Girl, finish the job. Finish the job! Go back! How is he fine? And supposedly he died before this. So how did he die before? Maybe that's something that I should have figured out before watching this. Oh, not the rat. Oh, I just got the chills down my spine. Nope, he's gonna jump scare you. He's gonna jump scare you. Mike, you gotta stay with everybody. Come on! Oh, thank goodness for those ads. Our palate cleanser. My stress and anxiety levels are right here, just in case you weren't aware. I'm gonna need to watch some Phineas and Ferb after this. I need a good, well, like I said, a palate cleanser. I need something to really just get me out of this universe. After all this, don't know if I'm gonna see the second one. All right, I am freaked the fuck out. Still out and about in the Miles County area. There was very clearly nothing in that. Come on, girl. At least put a little bit of water in there so we can get a little bit more realistic sipping. If you're just tuning in, this is not a Halloween prank. Be a very weird prank if that if it is a prank. How did he have time to do that? Where'd he get the supplies? Yes, I can very clearly see that there's chains on these doors. But I'm gonna try anyways. And while all that's happening, gonna make as much noise as possible. We're gonna see the pest control exterminator guy. Mutilated completely. Nope, it's... He had time to do an outfit change. Oh, wait, no, he didn't. He's still alive, actually. Oh! I was expecting him to get him. I thought he was gonna do a whole, a whole costume wardrobe change, but apparently not. Oh, what is that? Duct tape, that's it. Is everything duct taped? Okay, duct tape I feel like is pretty easy to get out of. Maybe it isn't. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know things. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. What are you gonna do? 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 This is literally nightmare cool. This is what nightmares are made of. See, this is an actual scary movie. I don't know what like movies nowadays are doing. This is actually scary, all right? 
me to cut it off. Michael Myers ain't scary no more. I don't know if he ever was. Maybe that's a controversial opinion, but I never thought Michael Myers was that scary. He didn't really do much. This guy is doing a lot. Look. He's just messing with her. He's just toying with her emotions. He's like, nah, actually you're gonna watch me do it to your friend, right? Oh! I mean, I was right. Why do you have to make her shirtless? I'm gonna have to cut some of this out. It's a little uh, much. Oh no, make her completely naked. Down the middle. Yes, down the middle. Uh. Ah! Oh no. I'm sorry I'm not freaking out more. I think I'm just shocked. Through the head, this guy is strong. Isn't there like a thing where like you can break duct tape if you just like relax or something? Oh gosh, oh gosh, oh gosh, oh gosh, oh gosh. Die, just stabs him once. Girl, that's not a die. Like you gotta freaking stab him in the head or like something. I mean, come freaking on. See, I don't really know if this movie is gonna have much of an, so why is he doing this? Who is he? Where'd he come from? Yada, yada, yada. But I kind of like that it isn't. I feel like in other classic horror movies, they rely heavily on the story of who the person is being scary. I kind of like the idea is like, we don't know anything about this guy and that's why he's scary. <laughs> I don't, I don't know too much about this stunt. Hit him more! Hit him more! Okay, don't antagonize her. Don't encourage him. All right, let's just beat his ass and get TF out of there. No! He's already down. Why, is she, why does she want him to fight more? Just bye! Kill him and bolt out. No, no. What the? Where'd he get that? In the same spot that she got stabbed or no? Where'd he get that? Hey, I would like to know. What does this lady have to do with anything? Run out of bullets? Is she like gonna be like his wife or something? That's what I'm anticipating. I mean, why else would she be like completely safe? Oh, just in the cheek. Not even in the head, head. In the brain. Come on, Art, what are you doing? And that was your last bullet. Palette cleanser, yay. So is the sister gonna end up being like the only one alive? So there's just a bunch of ammo in that bag and weapons. She's saying all this to her friend's phone, right? Because Tara's phone is actually dead, right? See someone that wasn't a continuity error. Somewhere on the back or something. Okay, okay, so it does say Dawn. Okay, so continuity in check so far. I mean, that, that's not even the weapon he used to kill her. It should have at least, like, it would have made more sense if he took a picture with her, with the weapon he used to kill her. You know what I mean? Okay, now she's dead. See, he knows how to kill somebody. I'm like Miss Tara, who could have killed him. She had every chance to kill him. Okay, wait, so she's not in on this. She doesn't know him. I thought she was gonna be part of it in some way, shape, or form. I don't know how, but all right. So she's spooked too now, I guess. I'm surprised this guy's still alive. Tbh. There's a dead woman in your basement. What? Dead, dead, all dead. He's killing them. Kill them. He's like, you're just Wait, crazy. If you don't go away right now, I'm gonna call the cops. Yes. <laughs> That's what I actually want you to do. <laughs> They're all dead. Get the hell away from me. Fuck is going on here. Oh, he's gonna be right behind you, man. Oh, he survived for a long ass time though, just doing his job. Tara. It's way too sketch to be venturing that far into the back. I, I mean, again, like, I don't know what I would do. I'd be like, okay, my sister is somewhere back here, apparently, but I'm too freaked out. Emily? 
See, this lady doesn't make any sense. She thinks that the doll is her kid, yet when she sees something like Art the Clown killing people, she is able to logically go and try and find someone and try to call the police. I feel like it just doesn't make sense. You know what I mean? It makes sense for other people to not to believe her because they established early on that she's kind of delusional, but still, I feel like it just doesn't add up, you know? <laughs> What kind of building is this supposed to be, anywho? <gasps> She's like, hey, that's my little doll. Give her back. I'm scared. <laughs> I mean, I've been scared this whole time, but I'm scared specifically right now. Is there kindness in you? Nope. I think we all know this. Ugh, I can't with him. I don't think he cares, bro. He literally saw sawed a woman in half. He's gonna bite her hand or something. I don't understand. He's gonna do something sadistic, anyway. Anywho. I guess not. Who's this guy? The guy that was on the phone? Mike, I'm outside. Every fucking door in this place is locked. The fucking last thing I do is. I mean, you're not wrong. He has like no music, too. There's the no music is what's really scaring me, too, TBH. <laughs> Yeah, just run, beach. You're alive. You got a working car. Let's go. Sorry, I would just leave and call the police. I mean, you got a working phone, a working car, and you're not harmed yet. Like, let's just go. She did. Let's just go. Hey, girl, you have all the ingredients to get out of here unscathed. Why are you doing this? She just loves the challenge. So I know you guys probably want to see my reaction. This is my reaction. Right, my reaction is that I need to hide behind my stuffed animal. This is why I have them with me. <laughs> it's not Tara. Art chewed off that lady's boobs, right? He scalped her. Oh, okay, that's kind of funny, the wig. What? I thought you were outside. Yeah, I thought you were right there. What? He has boobs? What is this? Silence of the Lambs all of a sudden? I can't help. The people here are not in like that much of a state of panic. You know what I mean? It seems like she's like, I need to grab it. Like the movements aren't fast enough. I'm confused. Does he have boobs or did he cut off someone's boobs and put them on himself? I mean, I don't understand how we would do that. He's like, bitch, I know you're there. Like, there's no hiding from me or the clown. Oh, he's gonna move over to that person now. Stupid old. But also, who leaves the key to a big building like that just under the mat? Under the doormat. <laughs> I feel like that's like a residential house thing. I don't think that should be a thing for like a giant building like that. There are not a lot of people in this movie. Oh, we have like the two guys beginning, two girls, the sister, him, Mike, and the terrifier. What is that, like seven people? Very small cast. Oh, and then the lady from the two people from the very beginning, right? So that's like, what, like nine people total. That's a really small cast. So is anyone gonna be able to kill this guy? Kill the terrifier. I don't want people to kill this guy. I mean, he's innocent. Innocent, I tell you. Oh, no. Well, so much for that guy helping us out. Double whammy. I mean, you already stopped him in the head. <laughs> oh, and he put his clothes back on. Remember in the beginning when I said that this was something that seemed like something I would like? I was wrong. Oh boy, was I wrong. I was so, so wrong. No one has ever suggested this to me. This is why. Because I think everyone knows that I was going to be terrified and hate it. Which is what's happening right now. <sighs> I think he is scarier than any other movie villain I've ever seen in my entire life. Oh, there we go. Honestly, a very calm, very calm death compared to what we've seen him do. <gasps> yeah, why did she just do that initially? <laughs> go, go, grab it. Dude, he doesn't make any noise at all. It's so odd. See, look like this. So she's so calm. Like no one's in a panic. Sorry, no one's in a panic. Oh, 
There's no way that guy is still alive. He got freaking like stabbed in the head. Oh, that's the sister. Oh, wait. Oh, is what we saw in the beginning? Oh, what we saw in the beginning was actually the future. This is, or I guess I should say it was present day and this is past. Everything that's happening now, this is all the past. What we saw all in the beginning was the future, right? That was a year later. That's the sister. We don't have time for this, come on girl. Uh, I, what? That guy crawled all the way down there, was able to knock him out. There's no way. Look at he's act he's like totally fine. He got shot in the freaking head or stabbed or I don't know. I forgot what already happened. I already forgot what happened with him. Something happened with him. With me. See, look at he's totally fine. Nine one one emergency. Uh, yes, I need the police and paramedics here right away. I think she's going. Tell them, tell them where. Hurry. We are not staying here. I'm taking this girl to the emergency room. I mean, that is risque. I don't know if my theory of what I said earlier about the beginning is true. <laughs> I don't actually know. Now that I'm thinking about it, that girl did not seem alive still. So no! Oh man, I like that guy. He's nice and actually helpful. Uh, oh, there just so happens to be a thing right, right back there. This guy's slow but fast. Like he can go every time. It's he's like Michael Myers. Every time we see him, he's super slow. But apparently, he gets to all these other places super fast. No, she'd have turned around. I can't believe she didn't turn around this that entire time she's doing that. What does she stab him with? I'm so confused. Every time it looks like they're outside. Apparently they're not? Like, I don't understand. How is she not outside yet? Now she's back inside? Like, I don't, I don't comprehend. <laughs> okay, that's, that's kind of funny. It's not, but it is funny. Scared, scared, scared. I don't understand. Wasn't she already outside? Why would she go back inside? Damn, those bitches came fast. Where do they live? Oh no, 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 no. Oh. See, why didn't she do that? So they were outside. So she was outside. Why didn't she just do that? I mean, he obviously was able to get in the car and leave. Oh, he's a cannibal as well. Possibly on. Let me see your hands. Just, just shoot him, just shoot him, just shoot him, just shoot him, just shoot him. Look, he's obviously eating someone. Last warning. You gonna get- Do it now, do it now, hurry! Come on, you guys are police. You guys can't see that he's going for a gun. Oh, no! He just shot himself. Don't go close. Don't go so close. She's still alive. He's still alive? Art is still alive? I mean, yeah, they had to leave it open for a sequel. <laughs> I mean, of course he's still alive. But it would make more sense for them to say she's still alive. I mean, I don't know. It is surprising that he is still alive during all this, but damn. Fuck. Well, seeing as how I'm going to be here for another 24 hours, thanks to you, uh, get me a breakfast sandwich with bacon or something with bacon. How can you eat a greasy croissant while you're cutting up dead bodies? Yeah. All right, once you've seen an eight-month-old microwave to death. That's a very specific line to add to the script. Yeah, yeah. I don't know why they why they said that. It's still alive. It doesn't look like there's anyone in there, man. He's still alive. Why is that part added in? That was something that was told to a girl earlier. The, you're really gonna like it here? That's something that the lady said to the girl. So why would that be over the phone thing? How is he not dead? He'll be in our prayers. Please, don't mention it. Well, you take care of yourself, Victoria. I'll see you in a couple Victoria. of minutes. Victoria. So that, that's the sister? So that's the sister? I don't understand. All right. That was a movie that we endured together. I'm gonna make this short and sweet because I wanna get out of here as fast as I possibly can. <laughs> First of all, I would like to give a big thank you to them for protecting me during this, my ride or dies. We love to see it. Thank you, very helpful. Mwah, mwah, mwah. And I would like to give a big thank you to whoever has never suggested this to me because you know me very well. And if you've ever suggested this to me, eh, okay. 
If you've ever suggested to me that I watch this movie, why? Just why? I understand now why people have never suggested this to me. Why people barely suggest this to me. It's only on my list because I've heard it talked about so much. Okay, so yeah, I'm gonna try to keep this short and simple. I hated this. I hate it, I hate it, I hate it. It was very scary. Sometimes I'm here for a good movie, not a scary movie. That's actually pretty much my entire channel is I'm just here for a good movie. It doesn't even have to be scary. This was just scary. And there were so many things that I feel like it just didn't make sense. One, the people were not in panic enough, the victims or whatever were not in panic enough. Two, there, w there wasn't even like a good soundtrack. I'm I'm sorry that's just my opinion i feel like you could at least have a very significant sorry i just like don't know what to my brain is just bleh, scrambled eggs right now um i feel like you can at least have like a very specific song for your movie you know what i mean like halloween is da, 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 da. you know what i mean and Jaws is da, 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 da. If this one was a little bit more iconic, maybe I would be like, okay, the soundtrack is actually pretty good. And I do appreciate that they didn't have any um, music during certain scenes to make it more scary because it did genuinely make it scary. This guy is Terry Fying. Will I be seeing the sequel? <sighs> Hell no. I will not be seeing the sequel. This movie is just so bad. I mean, I want to give it literally like a one or a two out of 10. I hated it. It was so nasty. It was so scary. It was just, it's, it was just too much, too much for me. You know what I mean? Because even if a movie is scary, if it's at least funny, all right. It at least has a good soundtrack. All right. If it at least has um, good visuals, all right. I'm listing off the things that this movie did not have. <laughs> good acting, good visuals, it was not aesthetically pleasing to look at. It was um, pretty dull, right? Like the color grading for this was just dull. It was just too nasty for my liking. I'm, I'm gonna very sparingly show this on YouTube because there's a lot that I just don't wanna see again. I'm not looking forward to re-editing this, just so you know. <laughs> I'm gonna try to edit this as literally as lightning fast speed as I possibly can. So I don't have to think about this movie ever again and we can move on with our lives. So those are my thoughts. With that said and done, I wanna give a huge shout out to all of my patrons and especially to Matt O'Keefe, AJ, Mark Sylvester, Maxi Moz, and Edward Fisher. Thank you so much guys. And make sure to go ahead and check out my Patreon if you haven't already. So if you want to endure this full length reaction with me, which you're crazy if you do, but if you want to, link for my Patreon will be in the description below. Go ahead, check it out. Thank you guys for coming along with me on this journey. Feels weird to say, because it wasn't a journey that I wanted to really endure, but I'm glad that I at least got to do it with my friends, you guys included. So with that, make sure to like, comment, subscribe, do all of that jazz. And as always, thanks for watching.